So this parkland is a $6 million investment into the Riverbank parkland. And for that, we're investing in local playgrounds, basketball facilities, trails, and uh, football fields. And along with that, Moreton Bay have invested $2 million out of their infrastructure contributions um, to bring this park into something that will last for generations. So the parkland is 1.5 kilometres long along the Caboolture River, 25 hectares or 50 acres. And it's going to feature great playgrounds, amenities, some space for basketball, kick around facilities, as well as trails for canoes and kayaks to access the Caboolture River. As, as we know, uh, Caboolture is one of the fastest growing areas in, in Australia. And it's all well and good to build homes, but people need things to do. And this is a massive investment, and I congratulate Pete and the Moreton Bay Regional Council for putting nearly, well it's 50 acres of playground and great space and the great thing I love about it is, is that there's access to the Caboolture River which is a hidden gem in this community and that will expose it to them and they'll be able to take canoes down there, there's going to be places where they can walk along the front there. This is really going to lift the profile of Caboolture and that's what it's all about. Look obviously council invests a hell of a lot into open space and sporting fields and that sort of thing but for me I think the most enjoyable journey is when there's a collaboration between council and Pete for instance where we can get our staff and their staff together and sort of negotiate how we want the outcome to be. So this is one of many parks within Riverbank and we've been developing this project over the last 10 years, connecting the Riverbank community to the local area with new bridges and parklands. We'll be developing here for about another five years and adding new parks and play facilities as we go.